I very much enjoyed my day with the 2017 Lincoln Continental. There were a couple features though that stood out so much, I thought I'd make a dedicated video highlighting them and going a little bit more in depth. So here we go. First off, the new Lincoln Continental has 30 way power adjustable front seats. Yes, 30 different ways. That's so many, I can't name them all. But to give you a little rundown, just the bottom seat cushion has six different ways of motion. The headrest alone has four different ways, up and down, forward and back. We've got ventilation, heated seats, massaging seats, but the massaging seats are cooler than normal. Usually you just get lower back, maybe up to your shoulders. These actually have basically butt massagers uh, that can be turned on individually from the back. So if you click a button right on the door, that activates the massage. Now popping up on the screen here is a whole bunch of different settings. You can turn off the butt massage if you want, or you can put it on high. Let's put the back and butt on high. It's actually a pretty intense massage. A problem with a lot of seats that have massages is they're not actually intense enough so you can barely feel them. I imagine that has a lot to do with making sure the leather survives uh, over time. But Lincoln has done a fantastic job making uh, it so you can actually feel the massage. Now let's go into the individual seat adjustments, shall we? You can click on the screen or activate it via uh, the controls on the side here. There are so many different ways you can adjust the seats. You've got a menu here on the screen now I'm not a seat expert, so I don't know the individual names of all of these features, but down here on the bottom that squeezes your legs, we can control the intensity of that. Just above that, we've got the side, lower side bolsters that we can adjust. Now we've got lumbar support above that, a second level of lumbar support, a third level of lumbar support, and then, as you can see here on the seat, there is a second level of back adjustment that's independent from the lower one. You can adjust that here on the toggle. Let's see, that's the recline. And here, you've got a separate incline and decline, recline, compared to the entire seat. What I've noticed is if you push this all the way forward, kind of like an office chair, if you lean back into it, it's a little bit springy. So that's kind of weird, takes some getting used to, but with 30 different ways, you absolutely can find the perfect seating position. In fact, if your legs get tired in a different manner, maybe your right leg is more tired because you're driving, well, you've got individual thigh supports that can be adjusted from the left or the right to extend and keep your legs in the right position. Absolutely insane. Now, a luxurious rear seat environment is nothing new, but in a car at this price range, it is pretty remarkable. We've got this large center console here that gives you control of basically the entire Continental. We've got climate control. We can even control the radio, the volume, what channel it's on. You can open and close the rear sunshade if you want. Although the side sunshades are manual, which is a bit surprising. You can open and close the moonroof from here. And these are even power adjustable, heated, ventilated, have lumbar support and massaging rear seats. This is a $4,300 option, but I think if you're ever gonna have people in the back, you absolutely need to. To activate the massage, click the button on the door here. And now we're getting a massage in the rear of a Lincoln Continental. They can recline and incline if you want. And you can even adjust in four different ways your lumbar support. That's pretty awesome. Lincoln engineers even took into consideration what's called the articulation index, or how easy is it to have a conversation with your passenger while the car is moving. And you can imagine it's pretty good. You can talk very quietly, even whispering to your passenger in the back seat as you relax in the rear of the Continental. If you shell out a bit of extra money to get the Lincoln Black Label trim of the Continental, that's the highest end trim, you get some pretty cool perks with it, namely Black Label membership. What that includes is four year, 50,000 mile maintenance plan, not warranty, maintenance plan. That includes items such as windshield wipers, brake pads, suspension. A lot of things that are normal wear and tear items that companies don't cover are actually covered by this maintenance plan. Pretty awesome. They also have remote vehicle delivery. They can pick up your Lincoln from your house, 
take it for service, drop it back off, or when you get the vehicle for the first time, they can drop it off wherever you like. You even get a once a year full interior and exterior detail complimentary. And if you care, they have a whole list of approved restaurants with good chefs throughout the United States. Very interesting. Kind of like a Amex black card in a way. One of the very innovative features of the Lincoln Continental is its e-latch door handles. If you notice on the side, it doesn't have normal door handles. It has these silver chrome handles that are integrated into the belt line or the window trim that look pretty cool actually. A lot of people think that it's weird looking, but that's just because we're not used to it. Now, they're electronic latches, so all you have to do if your key's in your pocket and the car's locked is walk up to the vehicle, reach your hand out, click the little button on the back part of the latch, and pull the door open. When you want to close it, you just simply shut the door, and on the B pillar is a little lock symbol. You just tap it, and then the vehicle locks. You can tell the mirrors fold themselves in. On the inside, apparently, this has some advantages. You don't have a door handle in the normal spot, so you can place speakers, apparently, in the optimal location for the highest quality of sound. We simply have a button that's located kind of at your pant level uh, that you can click and it unlocks the door. I'm not too pleased with where it's located because in order to open the door, the leverage is kind of strange, so you have to push it open with your elbow, but I think it is a cool step forward and definitely something unique to Lincoln's design. Now, this is really cool. You know Bose noise-canceling headphones? Well, the Lincoln Continental has active noise cancellation that does something very similar. In order to eliminate unwanted noises in the cabin, such as powertrain noises, there are microphones located throughout the Continental that are listening for harsh tones. They record that and they recreate the exact same note, but they play it 180 degrees out of phase. It's called destructive interference. And when they play at the same time, it cancels everything out and you don't actually hear anything. The fact that that's in a car, it makes a ton of sense and I think it's really cool from an engineering and technology standpoint to incorporate that to improve the ride quality. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Special thanks to Corporate Auto for hooking me up with the Lincoln Continental. It's available there now. Check them out. Link is in the description below. Please browse the channel and subscribe. I look forward to seeing you next video.